What up guys, we're at the 2019 LA Comic Con and for the first time ever, we are doing a JK News Live. Bye. We did JK News Live several times, but um, the other time we did it at a convention was at the LA Auto Show. We did that with Steve Aoki. We've done JK News Live once before, and that was with Steve Aoki. Awesome. And then, um, didn't we do uh, JK News with Steve Aoki? Uh, does that not count? Oh, fuck. That doesn't count with me. So exciting. I'm super excited. Yeah, wow, Pat. Um, that was I didn't, uh, I didn't appreciate you calling me out like that. That one but, doesn't um, count because uh, that was an auto convention. So it was another convention, but it wasn't the Comic Con convention. And it was at a at a car show or something. LA Auto. I think it was here too. And yeah, I was really really nervous when that was happening because Steve Aoki's there. There's an actual live audience. That was the first time I've ever been in front of people like other people. Wait, hold on. I feel very stupid right now. I'm sorry, Steve Aoki. But there was wow. also no audience. So it's a little bit different. Oh and, yeah, in uh, your face, Pat. And I didn't even really know if Steve Elke really wanted to be there, to be honest. Weird but exciting news. Weird. Studies show that millennials are finally interested in buying new cars. Yeah. What? I'm a big fan, but I don't know. <laughs> yeah, he was probably like, what are these fucking Asian people doing here? Yeah, he did like 12 shows, he seemed pretty tired. And it, it seemed like he was like, like Toyota made him do it. Okay, so for, yeah, it didn't count then uh, that we did it with Steve Aoki because there wasn't an audience. Now I'm remembering it wrong. It wasn't an audience. It was just at the show and people were walking by, but they did stop and they did uh, watch us. But I think this is going to be different than that. We're, we might be on a stage and stuff, so it is going to be like a level up higher than what we did before. So now I'm starting to get nervous. I wasn't nervous before this. Dang it, Pat. How many people do you think are going to show up? I don't know. LA? LA is hard to bring people out. You got, it's us competing with like a Real John, John Snow panel. Real I'd go to the John Snow thing. <laughs> yeah, you would get you. I think 10 people will be there. That's pretty good. Oh shit. Okay. He thinks less than 10, I think max 10. I'm really looking forward to the moment when I say whatever we want and see if anyone else follows in the crowd. That'd be really cute if they do. I'm actually scared because I feel like we're all going to talk over each other. Because if there's an audience, everyone gets hyped, right? Yeah. And so now there's like six people trying to talk all the time. Yeah. That's what I'm scared of. But I think it's going to be really fun. Yes, I've been to Comic Con before. It was pretty awesome. And I've been to Anime Expo. I've been to Comic Con. I've been to all these different like expos. And I always love coming here. Because people have really dope costumes. And the time that they take to make it all legit, I think I can appreciate that art. It's pretty awesome. I have personally been to the San Diego Comic Con. I feel like it's a ton of time crazier than this. And then we've had Barbell Brigade. Yeah, we've done a bunch of conventions, but this is my first time at a Comic Con. Oh. <gasps> My favorite comic book character? Well, I'm a Marvel girl. I love, uh, like, our family is a Marvel family. But if I would have to pick a favorite, I think, um, oh my gosh, I'm blanking on her name. The pressure. <laughs> Describe her powers and stuff. Dang it. It's literally, I think her name is literally Marvel. Captain Marvel? Yeah. <laughs> Captain Marvel! Oh my god. Now so, the nerves are really kicking in and now I'm gonna brain fart. Dang it. No, okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna do good. Yes, Captain Marvel is my favorite comic book character. She's awesome, she's a badass. Oh wait, hold on. I gotta think about this. Y'all know I don't do like comic book shit. I, you don't? I mean kind of. I don't know that much about comic book. Like I literally just referred to a Grand Slam as a Denny's meal and Gio had to tell me that it was for baseball. Does Jon Snow and uh, anyone from Game of Thrones count? My favorite? Oh shit, man, don't even tell. I... Okay, um, I think my favorite right now is Deadpool, before his movies, because he got ADHD like me. I'm gonna go with, I like Aquaman. Why? Because uh, he can swim and I admire him. Not just because of Jason Momoa? No, Jason Momoa too, yeah, I'm gonna double down on that. My hero is my mom. I'm just kidding. Uh, who do I like? Wolverine. Give me a good Wolverine, and I'm down to look at that. I think I just took yours. You did. I got nervous. You did. Wolverine's my hands down favorite superhero of all time. Fucking badass. He heals, which, like me, I like to sleep. He likes that, to work that'll, out. That's the same. It's kind of similar. Okay. He likes to work out. He's ferocious. I like being ferocious. And uh, he's introverted like me. Are you ferocious when you're little, Spook? Very ferocious. Sayonara! 
いつさよならさよならさよなら、ユーストピール You wanna be? This is the middle. Yeah. Hey guys, what's up? So, we're gonna do an off the record for you guys. Yeah. You ready? Let's do it. We're gonna talk about whatever、Where、we, we want. want. Awesome. Wait, wait, wait. One more time for、wait. Nick again.、Oh, God, God damn it. Nick's、oh、not my camera. Okay, one more time. I'll、we'll、do the whole thing. Pretend、intro、like I'm gonna do it. Okay, you guys have to pretend again. Okay, okay. pretend. 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 Best double penetration for those of you, and she got on on stage and she's like, "I just want to thank my dad because he like married his stepsister, married to his stepsister <laughs> and now I do porn and <laughs> what? Like, thanks for watching me take dicks." And then she <laughs> accepted the award. I thought that was the best acceptance yeah, speech、really、I've ever heard. We call it OTR now, like that. Yeah. Like it's a fucking yeah. You know, hey, what's your favorite、uh, OTR? Okay, my favorite conversation in the off the record. I like just vibing with the audience. It's really fun to. Ask them questions and、uh, try to incorporate them into the conversation. This is how I always feel when we have a guest on too, and they're not talking much. It's weird to do something where we're all engaged in the conversation and not bringing the people who aren't talking in. So it was fun to try to bring them into it, so that it was more of like we're all talking together, not just we're all talking around you. The whole time I was up there, I was so nervous and I was kind of like floating, so I wasn't really registering what was happening. <laughs> But、um, I think it was, I guess. The part that I remember being involved in was、uh, talk about video games. That was really fun. And then、uh, talking about how Isaac teabags Casey in the video game. But yeah, I had a great time though. It was really fun. It's just I was, I was really nervous. I didn't realize how nervous I was until I pointed out how nervous I was. And then that's when I got really nervous. Oh God, I can't post anymore.、Uh, favorite part about the after? Oh, I really like that. We're getting immediate like feedback from stuff that we say, and they were like、uh, the fan, like people sitting there. They were like asking questions directly to us. Like, as, like if we were saying a story, they were like, "Oh, what else did he say?" And I'm like, "Oh shit, that's nice." My favorite part was when、uh, Steve opens up and、uh, right in the beginning roasts Jess and Joe about the relationship. That's my legit、oh. intro. That's so、right. Joe, how's your、that's、breakup going? <laughs> my breakup. <laughs> yes. Great to meet you. Yes. 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 Yes.
wow, that's so cool that you yeah. were supporting like everything that we get our hands into. And I love how many people were like, where's Taika, where's Taika, where's Taika? I'm like, man, I should have brought him. So that was really cute. All the fans were really dope. Like a lot of them like didn't even know JK was gonna be here and they were kind of on the fence about coming to Comic-Con and then they were like, oh, as soon as we found out you guys were gonna be here, we got tickets. And that was really cool to just see like, like faces to the names. You see a lot of like, written words and comments, but we never get to see like the faces. And so that was really cool. Well, my first Comic-Con, I thought it was really cool. It was exactly what I expected. Like people with like the sickest costumes going around. Um, I do wish some people had a little bit more confidence in their costumes. Cause I saw a guy, he's in Venom outfit. And Venom is like a monstrous motherfucker, but this guy is still kind of like... So it's just really funny to see like a ferocious character. He's just like, hey guys, I'm Venom. I want people to own it. You know, like if you're a Robocop, start walking around like a robot. Well, this guy, Freddy Krueger, is behind us and he was lost. So he was just like... Yeah, yeah. He's not looking at his GPS. Like you yeah, can't that do that. If you're, if, you're, if you're a killer, you need to be like, as soon as you see something, boom! Go well, that way. Yeah, you should be walking like a killer. Person. Yeah. Like zombies at uh, Universal Studios. Okay, in closing, I just want to say, if you feel awkward, meeting all of us in person or whatever, don't because these motherfuckers feel way more awkward. Get a, get a cut of this real quick. Look at how weirdly they're all standing here. We're in the middle of fucking Comic-Con. Absolutely so much going on around you and they're all like... So, so if you feel that way, just know that these guys do too and we're all the same.